Hello and welcome in this short where I will be coding daily for 45 minutes to create a simple RPG game that runs on the ESP32 microcontroller. An important aspect of this challenge is also that I cannot use ChatGPT or other AI tools to help me with the code. As you can see, I already did a bit of work, so we have starting ground to play with. Right now, the game contains a player, a camera, which is able to follow the player, and a tile-based game world, which is randomly generated using cellular automata. Also note that currently the FPS are kept at 6 for testing purposes, but otherwise the game can run on 60 plus without any issues. Right now, the goal is to implement collision checks and prevent the player from walking through tiles that should not be walkable, but at the same time allow him to get as close to it as possible. The prevention part works already, but there is a bug that instead of allowing the player to get as close to the unwalkable tile as possible, the game freezes. So for today my goal is to try and fix it. So let's see what I can come up with in 45 minutes. Firstly, I realized that I should finally implement a function that converts world coordinates to tile coordinates. Since the complexity of the project is slowly but surely increasing, I decided to refactor a bit and instead of representing the tiles as simple integers, I created a tile class. Finally, I managed to get it to work well, at least partially, as intended. This means when the player moves in the positive x or y direction, the game now correctly allows him to get as close to the tile as possible. Unfortunately, when moving in the negative directions, the issue persists. This is because I'm trying to find the point that is as close to the water as possible using binary search, and today the 45 minute session wasn't enough time for me to implement it as generically to account for negative directions as well.